Oh, hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of All The Mods 4. Now, last episode I said I wanted to make some sort of cheaty cheat, well that's not cheaty cheat, but a super mining tool. Well, I have the diamonds now. Unfortunately for me, I got them the old fashioned way. That uh, farm, I have made a surplus of... Ooh. Make that now four. Um, I hadn't made a surplus, so I had to put another one on that because I got the one, then one out of it, and then I had to put it back down to. Hmm, and the emeralds are nice too. Um, get a little bit of leather. I'm going to need that soon for what I plan. I'm going to have to probably travel out since I still haven't seen any cows on this island. I've seen a pig, I haven't seen any sheep yet. But, um, I need leather, but that's later. Right now, I want the mining tool. So, uh, no, no, that one's mob drops. There we go. S sort of organised, but not completely. So, we are going to make mining gadgets. So, to make the mining gadget... Probably should have got some iron and ore smelting. Let's do that. Let's start off there. We're going to need, I think, a fair bit of iron, actually. Not entirely sure. Didn't really look. I figured out that I needed a certain amount of diamonds. I think it was seven. I'd forgotten it now, though, already. So, I got an excess of them. There we go. So, that's all them cooking. We are going to also need redstone. We've got the diamonds. Let's just grab, I don't know, just grab a bit of redstone. I'm sure we'll use it. Half a stack. Uh, what else do we need? Blank upgrade module, which is more diamonds, redstone, and lapis. That was what I was actually having the bigger problem with. I have more, uh, almost more. Diamonds, not a do lapis, that's lapis. Actually, how many do I have in total? Yeah, I almost do. Let's put half of it back. People can use it. Uh, I know we need some glass for this, I think, from memory. Let's make, actually, it's glass panes that I think that we need, so just about six. Damn it, we'll just chuck them all in one. We don't need them yet, so. So I'm pretty sure we got some glass panes left over from the windows. Eight of them. I thought we only had two. I must have made some more for something. Or someone else made some more. One or the other. Alright, so that blank upgrade. There we go, one of them. I want the rest. The mining gadget. Voila. That was so much simpler than what I remember it being the first time. So shift, right click, gives you upgrades, the size, its range, the visuals. So you've got the outer of the beam and the inner. So I'm going to make that half and full green. So that'll get me a uh, yellowy sort of colour. And I just want to go full green on the inner beam. Because I like green. And the blocks will shrink, or you can have them fade. I do quite like the shrink. I've seen this weapon tool used before. But if I'm clicking now, you can see nothing happens. So we need some power. Where is the charging station? sure I'm staring straight at it. Building gadgets? Okay. Uh, so we need some gold, more diamonds, redstone and lapis. So it's just the gold. We need four gold. 
Oh, I've got some. There we go. Let's chuck that in there. Take that glass out. I don't think we actually need it at the moment. Chuck it in storage. So we need to charge it. So we'll get a charging station. It's from building gadgets. I... Oh! I did not realise that building gadgets and mining gadgets were different things. And I have no idea how any of this building gadget stuff works. Hmm. Right. Well, for the future, I guess. I'm just after this for now. So we'll take it, but... So, charging station. Boop. Done. Created. And I'll just chuck it in the wall there. Now, I can burn stuff. Uh, what do we want? I got some coal there. That'll do. And we can make power. We can also hook this up to like solar panels or other types of generators with cable later on. But for the moment, we'll just burn stuff. Because we just want to get our first bit of power in here. So I can show this thing off. It's enough for now. So. Right click and you can see my beam. So green in the center and I've got a greeny yellowy color on the outside. And this thing is seriously awesome. It has such a cool, uh, keep going down. Why am I not sprinting? I'm on stairs, I guess. So here we go. Boom. Look at how much quicker that is. versus what I've been using. So much better. So we can get even more mining done now. And there's all sorts of upgrades and all for this too. So we've got efficiency, which is your speed. We've got five tiers of that. Ooh, that's remarkably cheap. That is. Wow, really, really cheap. I didn't realize that. We might have to at least make like one or two or something. But for that, we need a modification table to be able to modify it. That's surprisingly not too dear either. It's just these little lenses that's the dear bit. Two diamonds a piece. Yeah, we got 19 more. Once I've got super mining tool, I can go mine more for everyone else. So. That's my justification of it anyway. I suppose no one said I have to like give the others super mining tools either, so let's just roll with it and make a modification table. So I think we've still got everything I need in my inventory. So blank upgrade, just one of those. Uh, we'll need another one for the speed upgrade too. Let's make two. I really like that torch upgrade. I have no idea what that does. Does I've never even tinkered with this mod far enough to know. Um, what else we got? Freezing. I know what that does. That's really good for the nether because when those random pockets of lava that you come across, it turns it into obsidian. So that's really, really good. No idea what heat sink does. I can imagine magnet pulls everything in your mind towards you. That's the one that we want though. We really want the 3x3. Three three. This is why all of my tunnels are 3x3 three three, rather than you see a lot of people just do one wide tunnels because I knew I was going to head towards this. So we need ender pearls for that. So um, that will be the next step. Let's make this modification table. This was not planned. To make that, let's get a haste. Haste one. How many of these things do we have? 
Ooh, well, we got several stacks of it. So. Oh, there we go. 200 and something, I think, has come up. Yeah, let's at least chuck... Yeah, let's at least chuck two stacks back. And then whatever we've got left, we can use as desired, I think. So I've already got efficiency one. Let's go to two. Three. Four requires six of them. Yep. Ooh. Oh. Ah, who cares? Let's go. I'll get more. I will get more. So, I think I needed eight total. Did I need eight? So there's five? Yep. Ooh. Efficiency five. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Of course, this is going to put the amount of power that it chews up. So, let's put this modification table down. So actually, let's check that redstone back. Boom. So, that goes in there, goes in the top, and we push it across into the device. And now when I shift right click, I can see I've got efficiency five true, or I can, can disable it if I want, just at a click of a button if I want to save power. I'm just trying to get somewhere, but, ooh, I'm excited now. Let's go test this thing out. This is going to be so cool. I wonder if there's any like boots of haste or anything. Something that makes you faster in this one pack. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to look into this. Now, I've been mining in this particular direction because this is the direction that Cezatrix lives. Um, and that way I can get a safe tunnel to her location. So. I've just been... Hmm. That's fast. I was kind of expecting faster, but don't get me wrong. Wow. <laughs> just wow. And it's not really chewing through the power too harshly. Like I thought it might be worse. Oop, and there's more diamonds to replace all the diamonds we've used. I said it wouldn't take long. Down the bottom left for anyone that missed it. Cool. And this has got, I don't know what its mining level is too, but it's quite high because I just picked up redstone and all there. I think it can do obsidian as well. But I... None of its mining range, fortune. No, there isn't one for my, for like a tier upgrade. So maybe that's just as high as it goes. We will want that silk touch. I have not seen any slimes though. Oh, jellyfish. This, I've seen jellyfish out in the water. Yep. I'm just going to have to go kill some jellyfish. Because... Or, or do we want fortune? That's a lot of lapis, and we haven't found much lapis. I think we'll go with Silk Touch, because I'm pretty sure through smelting stuff you can double your uh, output, so... I think we'll go with Silk Touch instead. And if... I don't think it's been brought to it yet, but the mechanism that I imagine at some point will come to this mod pack. And I remember old mechanism used to be way better than Fortune, because you used to be able to get up to times five um, or in mechanism. So hopefully that will come to this mod pack eventually. It's been in previous versions of all the mods that I've played, so um, hopefully it comes here. So I need to get some jellyfish for that silk touch, and I need to set up an area where we can hunt Enderman. That will be the next step. Awesome. So I will, I don't think I'll bring you back for jellyfish. There's nothing really exciting about diving down under the ocean. 
chasing uh, fish, but I will bring you back as soon as uh, I've got some ender pearls, and I will show you how I managed to relatively safe. I'm not going to say that I haven't been killed many, 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 many times while hunting Enderman, but I think it's a better way than just randomly running around in the night. Um, the way I hunt Enderman. So I'll bring you back once I've built that setup and we should be all good. Oh, there's another one there. Our first Enderman. Right on daytime too, so I shouldn't have to worry about other things. I'll show you this uh, little contraption of mine very shortly. So let's kill these. One down. I didn't see another one drop. I think we got one. I think we got unlucky. No, we got lucky. Ha ha. Don't my inventory so I don't accidentally throw it. Kill this creeper because I don't like creepers. There we go. So this is it. So there's a nice little ledge here so that skeletons and all when they come closer to you will jump off on it and you can safely bash them in the foot. I've got a slab here so that nothing can then jump up on top of it like I'm trying to now. Um, and it's only too high on the inside so Enderman can't teleport in on you. I should make this an iron door but I didn't bring any iron with me out here. And basically the idea is you just sit in here, you stare around looking for an enderman. Most things ignore you while you're in here unless they seem to get really really close. Um, the idea of the trapdoors is for skeletons because originally I never had them and skeletons would just shoot you and drive you nuts and kill you. So you just wander around Look, 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 all night, in safety. When you spot an Enderman, pop down a couple of things so you can look at it. When Once you look at him, he gets angry. He comes over to you, you lump him in safety like I just did, and voila, you have Ender Pearl. So, we've got our first one. Now, I'm thinking... I'm going to use that to get, uh, um, get more of those plants from um, attained drops. But I haven't got any more of those essence yet, so I need to go and just kill some zombies and other things, and then I can go back and we can make that final upgrade, and then we will have the mining gadget of absolute awesomeness. Be right back. Alrighty. As long as I haven't missed anything, this should conclude our goal. So, golden apple. Uh, gold, uh, the blank. I got a park, paint of glass. Oh, I'm missing everything else. Uh, I need more diamonds. Other two diamonds. Alright, I missed something. Redstone. Four redstone. Lapis. Was it two? I think it was two. Blank upgrade, there we go. Silk touch, done. And the big one that I really wanted, the 3x3. Three three. Uh, oh, mm -hmm. maybe not one of them. Actually, oh, I didn't mean to grab that. Grab a lot of redstone, um, two more diamonds. Yeah, grab too many. Uh, I think that's it. So I need four blocks of them. One, two, three, four. Of course, there was something I forgot. Uh, two lapis. Of course, I forgot to make the blank upgrades. There we go. Another blank one. And diamond pick, diamond block, into pearls. Voila! 3x3 three three upgrade at our Silk Touch. We've done it. Gotten where I wanted to get. So, modification. Put it in there. We can see our efficiency 5. Boom! Now we do 3x3. Three three. 
and boom we also do silk touch so the only one that i really want to get but i'm not going to get it at the moment is the snowballs that's the last one that i want let's go have one quick go of this because i'm excited about it go right down to the bottom of our mine and test out our weapon of awesomeness wow this mine's getting very long now We're getting close to scissor tricks and that was where our end of farm was to is the e well it's not, not really an end of farm but it's what we're using it was a nice flat plains where uh, we had a good long distance so we're using the silk touch we're using the efficiency Change the size by three by three. I still don't know what proficient mode is, but hmm. oh yeah, that's what we want. Dirt and all. How much mining am I going to get done now? Might even get a tunnel all the way to Caesar Tricks. Not the diamond. Not sure. But anyway. Thank you very much for watching another episode of All the Mods with me. If you did like the episode, please hit the like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.